In this short video I will demonstrate three ways how to carry a worm. That's the easiest one and quickest one, that's a little bit more complicated and that's the most complicated. Before going any further I have to mention that for this video I will be using fake worms or just plastic silicone worms. Those are more or less the same size as real worms, as real dendrobinas, etc. Obviously when you will be fishing on your own and when you will decide to hair the worms, please use real worms and not fake ones. By far the easiest way to hair rig a worm is just to use a hair rig with a band on it. Those are very very small and they must be very small. In this case I have Drennan micro pellet bands and uh, I have to mention that this rig will work only if those pellet bands are very small. Otherwise the worm will be able to wriggle out of the pellet band. And all you do is just grab a pellet bander and stretch the, the band. And you want to grab your worm and hold it like just like that, like double it over and then stretch the band and put the worm inside whilst it's being doubled over. And as I mentioned, if the band will be small enough, the worm won't be able to get out. And actually, if you will be using decent sized worms and small bands, quite often you will be able to catch a few fish on a single hook bait. And it's very easy because when the hook bait will get damaged after a couple of fish maybe or something like that, it's very easy to replace the hook bait as well just by pulling it out. Bang, and you are ready to put a fresh one on. Perfect. Very popular way of hair rigging a worm is just by breaking the worm in half more or less. Then grabbing a needle and uh, just threading the worm's head more or less through the needle, through the head more or less, and then doing the same with the other half. And then sliding those worms onto the hair, just like that, one by one, gently. And then just using a bait stop to stop the worms and fix them onto the hair rig. Obviously, as you can see, this way is not the quickest, but it's quick enough. Bang! Two worms nicely onto the hair. Also, this rig has the advantage that you can change the hookbait pretty quickly or remove the damaged hookbait very quickly. Just like that, just removing the bait stop and pulling the baits off the hair. Bang! Awesome! This is by far the most complicated way to put a worm onto the hair. Basically, you need to have a band, pellet band, in the hair and then you do the following. Just thread the worm onto the needle just like that so the needle would go through the worm's head. Then hook the band into the needle and slide and also you want to keep the band extended so it would be lower in diameter and then just whilst holding the band extended pull the worm onto the hair and then the band is outside. Then you grab the pellet bander tool, extend it or use it to extend the band and then you put the worm through the, through the band. Just 
just like that. And now the band is nicely gripping the worm as well. I would say that this way probably is the most secure. The worm will never ever come off, especially if you will be using like smaller pieces. And I have to say that this kind of presentation just looks beautiful as well. And it will be it from me for today. I hope that you will find this video useful. I believe one of these three methods should be useful in your own fishing. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.